Hey, what's going on YouTube? I uh, just kind of wanted to answer a question. We had a question basically someone asked. Uh, they wanted to install Windows on their Mac, but they already had installed uh, or had partitioned their hard drive. So obviously when you go here and you go into your applications, you're going to go to your utilities and you're going to see Boot Camp Assistant. If you've already partitioned your hard drive, once you continue, once you continue past this point, instead of coming up with a nice uh, "let's continue" message, you're going to come up with a message saying, "Hey, you've already, uh, you've already partitioned your hard drive. We can't help you." Well, there's a work way around that. There's a workaround for that, and basically, it's quite simple actually. Uh, if you actually re restart your computer with your Mac OS X install disk repartition your hard drive create a new partition in MS DOS format then whenever you uh, you'll restart your computer again after it partitions and you know you don't even have to delete your current partitions just make a new partition once you get that new partition up and going you'd restart your computer with the Windows CDN hold down your C key or your uh, your option key your option key and then you select the Windows CD that you have in the drive or your C key D. C key and it will automatically uh, boot up with your boot up with your CD. From that point on, uh, you'd go through the Windows installer. It would tell you to select the hard drive. You would format that hard drive to a FAT 32 or 64 or whatever the, your Windows install CD is telling you to do it. I just did this on a MacBook Pro, uh, 2010 13-inch MacBook Pro, and it actually worked flawlessly. Um, so I've, I've tested it out on a machine. I've also tested it out here. This is a 21 inch iMac. And basically, from that point then you're going to get you're going to be on your system. After you install Windows, insert your product key, <clears throat> you have your new partition. Basically it's going to say, hey, uh, you know, you're going to say, hey, my trackpad's not working right. My Apple key's not working right. I can't right click. That's all fine. On your Mac OS 10 CD, you would put it in. There's going to be a folder. It's going to be called Windows Support. Uh, in that actual, in, in on your Mac OS 10 CD, it's going to be called Windows Support. Once you open that folder up, it's going to have setup.exe in it. You're just going to open up setup.exe within your within your Windows booted partition. So you boot it up with Windows. And basically, you're just going to open up setup.exe. It's going to install all your drivers. From there, your iCam is going to work, your glass trackpad. Most of your gestures will work, uh, not the three finger gesture, of course, but for right click, obviously, two fingers, click down. Um, most of your other gestures will work. You know, a scroll up to scroll down, two fingers. So that's just a little tip. Uh, a lot of people have been asking this question, and so we just kind of wanted to answer that question for you guys. Um, and if you have any other questions, comment below or read the more info for further information on how you can get support on this issue and more. Thanks for watching.